Alright, right here, this is gonna be my last Simeon car that I had to repo or sell or whatever you wanted to call it. And we are about to complete another career challenge here in Grand Theft Auto V. I've been working on this diligently. Pretty ironic that this is the second career challenge that I've completed within the same day. But we've been working on things here diligently, so now since this is completed, I can move on to more challenges and try to get those completed. So we can go ahead and unlock those really rare outfits that are being in the game. Alright, so career challenges, we're going to go all the way over here to enthusiast stuff right here. So vehicle enthusiasts. That's what I've just completed. So the first one right here, what we're going to go ahead and talk about is you have to own a garage with at least 10 spaces. You have to customize a vehicle in the Los Santos Custom Shop, and you have to own a Pegasus vehicle. That one's super easy. Next one is going to be you have to test drive or purchase a vehicle from the uh, Premium Deluxe Motorsport or the Luxury Autos, which is the Luxury Autos is right across there from Dr. Dre's. Upgrade a vehicle uh, at the custom vehicle at the Benny's Original Motorsport uh, thing there. And then upgrade a vehicle with HSW Performance Upgrades uh, over at the Hayos Special Works at the LS Car Meet. Ended up getting that one done. That's a lot of stuff right there. And then the next one here is upgrade a vehicle. Oh, hold on. Gonna see if I got that challenge. Okay, here we go. So upgrade a vehicle in the arena. Uh, so you just have to upgrade a vehicle in the arena. That's fine in that workshop. And then customize a vehicle uh, with a Nami tech over at the agency. We've completed that. And then it says right here, earn five gold medals in flight school challenges. You guys, that was super easy. We ended up getting that done years and years ago. So of course, that's already gonna be checked off for me. If you haven't done any of those challenges, just be working on them one by one, I would suggest. And here's the last one. Unlock 10 Platinum Awards for Vehicles. 10 out of 10. That was the more challenging one. I'll talk about that more towards the end of the video. Own 100 vehicles, including one special vehicle. 100 out of 100. And then also own a vehicle in each of the 15 different vehicle classes. So like, you know, a muscle car, a sports car, a compact car. You got to own them all at one point. And then the last one is customize 50 vehicles, uh, which was super easy to do over at the Eclipse Tower because I got like 60 cars in there. And all I did is just change like one thing on the vehicle and then change it back. So you guys, I've just completed this. And the longest thing in here, I would say, is going to be the tier four right here. Unlock 10 platinum awards. And then we get some vehicles. So it looks like I get that truck right there, which I just put in one of my garages. Little tow truck or whatever. And then let's see what else we get. We get a quarter of a million dollars, I believe, right there. And then also on top of that, we're going to uh, end up getting $10,000. So yeah, I've been working on this challenge along with some other challenges every single day because I'm slowly trying to knock this stuff out uh, to where I can get up to, you know, getting some more unlocked rare outfits in the game. Um, yeah. But anyways, from there, you guys, here we go. I ended up getting another career challenge done in the same day so all of these are done right here there's only two of them in the special interests which i can imagine at some point there might be more who knows but yeah those are all done and all these right here require a lot of work and potentially a lot of people's help helping you out getting this stuff done uh but anyways from there you guys yep once again this is another career challenge and i have completed it and as long as i am completing these i just want to go ahead and share with you uh, like how I've done it and gotten it done and stuff like that to where you guys can probably easily just go through I mean a lot of this stuff is self-explanatory it tells you everything that you need to do but other things too like what I would say it's a lot easier sometimes just getting a friend and having them help you uh, if help is required which hopefully you guys do have some sort of boosting friend all right so in the stats right here in awards there are vehicle yeah, in every single one of these, you guys can see, this is going to be the more challenging thing, I would think, right here, is trying to complete every single one of these. Because you can only do one Simeon vehicle a day. That's the one that I just completed uh, for here. But there's 10 of them in here, and there's a lot of potential work that has to be done within just this uh, perimeter, or priameter, whatever you want to call it of you know just that one little task right there that you had to do for the career challenge but luckily i play a lot of grand theft auto it's my favorite game which is why i youtube it and stuff like that trying to help other people out knowing the knowledge that i know and stuff like that but anyways from there you guys yep if you want to see more videos like this hit that like subscribe button 
Uh, leave a comment. Let us know like what challenges have you guys completed already because I'm still working on them and we are going for that Trevor outfit. So hopefully we can end up getting there. But anyways, so there if you guys enjoyed the video and it was helpful, uh, hopefully it was. Thanks for watching. My name is Gravesite and I'll see you in the next one. So peace.